What is going on YouTube? Today I'm bringing you a review that I'm super excited about and I just picked this up from a buddy and that is the Protec Strider Collaboration, the Auto and it's going to be their version of the SNG. Give you a nice little close look at it right now if it'll focus. See the nice Strider logo right there. The three pin construction, the three screw construction. Characteristic of the SNG. Then you see on this side the ProTech logo, made in the USA, that's always great. And the Strider pocket clip with the lanyard hole, the pivot. And let's, uh, let's take a look at this real quick. These scales, obviously SNG inspired, pretty much just the same as an SNG as far as width and length and all the, all the dimensions go. Uh, however, they are both made of aluminum. Excellent texture. Excellent texture on the, on the scales. It mimics G10, somewhat of the Lego grip, but maybe even a little bit more aggressive. Uh, it, it bites and it gives you grip, but it's not overbearing. It doesn't cut you up. It doesn't hurt you. It doesn't abrade you. Just... Excellent craftsmanship there by Protec. This is a collaboration between Protec and Strider. Um, it is built by Protec. The only part on this blade that is provided by Strider themselves is the pocket clip. This is a titanium pocket clip. This is a Strider pocket clip, the same that would come on your SNG, your CC, uh, your Double DG, uh, the, the gunner grips. Um... It, it This is a Strider pocket clip. The only piece on this blade that is actually from Strider. Everything else is an inspiration. It's a uh, Protex take on the SNG, but in an automatic format. Here you see the safety featured. Obviously up is safe. Down, it's ready to go. And here is the button for deployment. You'll notice how it's recessed and flush fitting to the frame to the scales of the knife. I really like that. It prevents unnecessary deployment and it rides nice. Uh, if we could get this to focus. Oh, there we go. With the safety, obviously if the safety's on, unless there's a mechanical malfunction, it will not deploy. However, if the safety is off and that's how you prefer to carry it, the button is recessed inside this space here, which is a nice feature and allows it to not be easy, easily deployed unintentionally so it's off safe and we're going to deploy the knife check out the action here this knife has such a great action it just flies out of there i love that such a great action let's take a look at it deployed if it'll focus here for us here you'll notice the strider logo i love that I love having that on a knife finally i couldn't really bring myself to buy a 400 500 and an up dollar knife, um, but I do love Striders. I think their ergonomics are amazing. I think the blade shape is perfect. I think the the construction is excellent, and uh, this is a great way to get into a Strider uh, without having to shell out all the money. It's basically an, an automatic SNG made by another company, obviously approved by Strider and uh, collaborated with here on this side, you'll see the ProTech USA, as well as 154CM. That is the blade steel. Uh, it's used on a lot of Benchmades. It's used on some Spydercos, as well as some other higher-end knives. Uh, it's a decent steel. It's, it's more of a super steel. However, it's one of the weaker super steels. Uh, it's a little bit softer. It can get super sharp, but it's it needs to be touched up and resharpened a little bit more often than, say, a CPM S30 or S35 VN, something of the sort. I've been carrying this blade for uh, about a week now since I got it. It's excellent. The ergonomics are amazing. You get the, the classic Strider grip, um, Strider scales, excellent ergonomics. This forward choil allows you to choke up on it along with the excellent jimping of the blade. Really gives you a lot of control doing some, some finer tasks or maybe some heavier work. The action on it is amazing. The blade centering is perfect. Take a look at that there.
it's an automatic so obviously you get that quick action it, it flies out of there it, it it's just a great knife and for the price that they're asking for these you can't go wrong uh, it's every bit of strider as it is protec obviously protec is protec is the one who um, who manufactured this blade and then this pocket clip right here again it's a titanium pocket clip and it is a true strider pocket clip provided by strider um, that is the only piece of strider in this blade but obviously anybody who knows anything about strider can tell uh, the influence, the design, obviously it has the classic blade shape, the jimping, as well as the scales and the shape of the scales, the, the three screw construction. Um, everything is Strider through and through other than the fact that it is manufactured by Protec and it is an automatic. But for an automatic, if you know anything about them, Protec is an excellent brand to purchase from. If you're looking for an automatic, they're excellent knives. I've really enjoyed fondling this, playing around with it, using it for EDC. The action is so smooth, it flies out of there with authority. And uh, every time I look at it, you know, it, it to me it's a strider. You know, I don't have a lot of money to spend on blades. You know, when it comes to four, five hundred, six hundred dollars for a knife, I'd much rather go buy another gun with that money. However, I have a strong appreciation for Strider Knives and their company and what they represent and the quality that they bring to the table. And this is an excellent way to get into a Strider without actually paying all that money. It's not a true Strider. Obviously, you know, you could relate this to the Emerson Kershaw collaborations or other collaborations around the road, you know, down the road that have happened. You know, obviously Strider has collaborated with Buck. Those knives haven't been that well produced. Uh, they bring a lot of money because they're rare on the, on the secondhand market. But something like this is a quality, usable knife that gives you the best of both worlds. Protec is known for their autos. You got that feature. Strider is known for its durability, its style, its functionality, and its elegance all in one package. And I really think that it comes through with this blade. Uh, again, this is the Protec Strider SNG Automatic. And uh, you'll see here, if this will focus, it says PR2. Oh, where are we going? Let's see here. Eh. All right, well, th this verbiage right here says PR2, hashtag 281. I believe that stands for Production Run 2, their second run of production for these style of blades. And they are numbered because there was only a certain amount made. And this is the 281 produced. Uh, so that's kind of cool. It's still a production knife. However, you know, it is numbered. There are limited runs of this. And uh, it, it gives you that information. But overall, I'm extremely impressed. I love this thing to death. I can't wait, you know, to put it to good use and, and to work it out. And just enjoy it because I've always wanted a Strider. And uh, for now, this is about as close as I'm going to get. But I'm enjoying every second of it. And again, that's the Protec Strider collaboration, the SNG Auto. Made in the USA. Every bit of Strider as it is Protec, if not more. And uh, I love it. You can't beat this with a stick. And as always, that's your boy Terribly Tactical reminding you to stay safe. Stay armed. Always be prepared. And don't ever think about treading on me. Peace.